Are you interested in working in the medical field? There are plenty of career options that allow you to make a difference in people's lives without having to go through the extensive training required to become a physician. In this video, we will look at several medical careers, from registered nurses to medical social workers. We'll cover the education and training requirements, job duties, and average salaries for each profession. Number 1. Registered Nurse. The average salary for a registered nurse is around $75,000 per year. Registered nurses provide patient care, including administering medication, monitoring vital signs, and assisting with medical procedures. They also educate patients and their families about medical conditions and treatment plans. To become a registered nurse, you can complete a nursing program, either a bachelor's or associate's degree. An associate degree program typically takes two years, while a bachelor's degree can take four years. In addition to completing a nursing program, you must pass the National Council Licensure Examination, NCLEXRN, to obtain your nursing license and practice as an RN. Some nursing programs may also require the completion of specific prerequisite courses before admission. Number 2. Physician Assistant, PA. The average salary for physician assistants is around $115,000 per year. Physician assistants provide diagnostic, therapeutic, and preventive healthcare services under the supervision of a licensed physician. They can conduct physical exams, order and interpret diagnostic tests, and prescribe medication. To become a PA, you typically need to complete a master's degree program in physician assistant studies, which can take two to three years. In addition to completing the program, you must also pass the Physician Assistant National Certifying Examination in order to obtain your PA license and practice as a physician assistant. Some PA programs may also require the completion of specific prerequisite courses before admission. Number 3. Medical Assistant, MA. The average salary for a medical assistant is around $35,000 per year. Medical assistants perform administrative and clinical tasks in medical offices, clinics, and hospitals. They can take patient histories, prepare patients for exams, and assist with medical procedures. They also handle administrative tasks such as scheduling appointments and managing patient records. To become a medical assistant, you can complete a certificate or diploma program, which typically takes around one year to complete. Some medical assistants may also choose to earn an associate degree in medical assisting, which can take two years. In addition to completing a medical assisting program, some states require medical assistants to obtain certification by passing an exam. Number 4. Medical Researcher. The average salary for medical researchers is around $88,000 per year. Medical researchers conduct scientific research to advance medical knowledge and improve patient outcomes. They can design and conduct experiments, analyze data, and publish research findings in academic journals. To become a medical researcher, you typically need to earn a doctoral degree in a relevant field, such as biology or biochemistry. This can take around four to six years of additional education after earning a bachelor's degree. During the doctoral program, medical researchers may take courses in research methods, statistics, and data analysis, as well as conducting original research in their chosen area of specialization. After earning the doctoral degree, many medical researchers complete postdoctoral training programs that can last one to three years. These programs provide additional research experience and can help researchers to develop their skills and knowledge in their chosen area of focus. Number 5. Healthcare Administrator. The average salary for healthcare administrators is around $100,000 per year. Healthcare administrators manage healthcare facilities and services. They can oversee budgets, develop and implement policies and procedures, and ensure compliance with healthcare regulations. They also collaborate with healthcare professionals and stakeholders to improve patient care and outcomes. To become a healthcare administrator, you can complete a bachelor's or master's degree program in healthcare administration or a related field. A bachelor's degree program typically takes four years to complete, while a master's degree program can take an additional one to two years. Some healthcare administrators may also have a degree in business administration, public health, or a related field. In addition to completing a degree program, healthcare administrators may need to gain experience in the healthcare industry and obtain certification. 
Certification is only sometimes required, but it may be preferred by employers and can demonstrate competence and professionalism in the field. Number 6. Medical Social Worker. The average salary for medical social workers is around $60,000 per year. Medical social workers provide support and counseling to patients and their families dealing with medical conditions. They can help patients navigate the healthcare system, connect with community resources, and provide emotional support. Number 7. Physical Therapist. PT. The average salary for PTs is around $90,000 per year. Physical therapists help patients manage pain, improve mobility, and prevent disability. They can develop treatment plans, perform exercises and manual therapy techniques, and educate patients on proper body mechanics and injury prevention. To become a physical therapist, you must complete a Doctor of Physical Therapy, DPT, program, which typically takes three years to complete. In addition to completing the DPT program, physical therapists must pass a national licensing exam to practice in the United States. Some physical therapy programs may also require the completion of specific prerequisite courses before admission. If you're at the beginning of your career or considering a career change, we hope this video may provide you with some ideas on how to discover a satisfying and gratifying occupation in the medical domain. Also, it's important to conduct research on the specific requirements for the medical specialties that interest you. This will ensure that you meet all the necessary education and training requirements. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give us a thumbs up, subscribe our channel, and leave a comment below.